Good day everyone, today I will be discussing to you the parallel lines cut by a transversal and the different definition postulate and theorems. Let's start with, if you have a parallel line cut by a transversal, vertical angles are congruent. Corresponding angles are congruent. Alternate interior angles are congruent. Alternate exterior angles are congruent. Linear pairs are supplementary. When we say supplementary, the sum of their measures is equal to 180 degrees. Same side exterior angles are also supplementary. And same side exterior angles are also supplementary. Okay. So if you're going to add the two pair of angles, they will give or uh, the sum is equal to 180 degrees. Now, uh, to apply our postulate theorems and definitions, let's use this figure. Uh, in the figure, measure angle 2 is equal to 75 degrees. Find the measure of the remaining angles. So angle 2 is 75 degrees. Uh, that is the given. So we're going to find angle 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So let's start with measure angle 1. We know 1 and 2 are linear pair. So the sum of 1 and 2 is equal to 180 degrees. So 180 minus 75, that is 105. Okay. So... Measure angle 1 is equal to 105. Prison, linear pair. Okay. 1 and 2 are linear pair. Okay. Let us complete. Because, because measure angle 1, uh, because angle 1 and angle 2 are linear pairs. Next, measure angle 3. Okay. If this is 105 and angle 2 is 75 degrees, measure angle 3 is also 105 degrees. Why? Vertical angles are congruent. 1 and 3 are vertical angles. So, angle 1 and angle 3 are vertical angles. Next, angle 4. So measure angle 4 is equal to 75 degrees. Reason? Angle 3 and angle 4 are vertical angles. Next, angle 5. So measure of angle 5 is equal to, so corresponding angles. Do you have corresponding angles here? No, we don't have. So we can use the theorem alternate interior angles are congruent. So, alternate interior angles, so we have 3 and 5, they are alternate interior. So, angle 5 is equal to angle 3, so 105 degrees. Angle 3 and angle 5 are alternate interior angles. Alternate interior angles. If angle 5 is 105, therefore, measure angle 6 is equal to... So, if we're going to use the alternate interior angle, we can use angle 4 and 6. So, angle 4 and 6 are congruent, so 4 is 75, so angle 6 is 75 degrees. Angle 4 and angle 6 are alternate interior angles. Now... Angle 7, angle 7 is 105, angle 7 is 105 because 
5 and 7, angle 5 and angle 7 are vertical angles. And last, measure of angle 8 is equal to 75 degrees because angle 6 and angle 8 are vertical angles. So, we're done in getting the remaining measure of the angles in a parallel line cut by a transversal. Again, vertical angles are congruent, corresponding angles are congruent, alternate interior angles are congruent, alternate exterior angles are congruent. Linear pairs are supplementary, same side interior angles are supplementary, and same side exterior angles are supplementary. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV.